In this video, let's look at the new experience features we have added to Oracle Analytics Cloud with the September 2022 update. Oracle Analytics Cloud now allows the users to provide a custom column name for table and pivot table visualization. In my use case, I want to rename my column P3LOB to something like line of business. To do this change, uh, let's go to the property panel, select the labels property tab of the property panel, expand on the column name, a new property called display header is shown to the user. Changing this to custom allows the user to provide a custom name that is now displayed on my uh, UI. The same functionality is also available on pivot table. In this example, I have renamed my column C50 region to something like my region. A new filter experience along with new capabilities is now available on Oracle Analytics with the September 2022 update. New compact style filters provide easy access to commonly used filtering actions such as top, bottom, end, exclude, include data, limit by and disabling filters. We have also added new filter operator support when using date filters. Users can now provide selective dates in addition to providing a range of dates to filter data more easily. We have added a filter bar menu option that allows the user to show or hide values and set a default option. Show height filter values is also available as an option on the individual filter bills on the workbook filter bar. A custom message can be added on visualizations when there is no data returned for the visualization. In my use case here, the user is trying to filter for a specific city for which there is no data returned. Author can now customize this UI message by going to the workbook properties and changing the no data text property from auto to custom and providing a custom UI message. Thank you for watching the video and have a good day.